Hey Virgos, welcome or welcome back to the channel. Hope all is well. So today I'm going to be doing a reading for you all. Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, North Node. Come on in, take what resonates, leave the rest. If there's anything that you need to know in regards to how to get a reading from me, please do reach out to me via email as all the links or email will be in the description box below. Thank you guys so much for your love and support. I really do appreciate it. Be sure to head on over to my other channel if you guys are into collective reads, prophetic messages, and or anything else that you would need to know in regards to any other sign other than Virgo. I'm also starting to incorporate earth sign readings. So be sure to head over there if you guys are interested okay if you guys are looking to get a reading i will be responding and uh getting ready to do those readings in just a little bit okay let's see what's going on here for virgo what do we need to know you could be working on releasing something this could be a song a um emotions Whatever this may be. It looks like you're releasing anything that does not serve you or allow you to have fulfillment. Okay? Because you're not feeling that right now. You feel like there's no way out. You kind of feel trapped within uh, yourself. And it's time to start applying power that you have. And purifying who you are. Making a change. Okay? Because you staying the same is blocking your abundance. Let's see what else is going on here. What do we need to know? So look at the bigger picture is showing up with new full moon in Sagittarius. And it says take time to breathe out. Hmm. There, there's some sort of answers that you're not getting or that you feel like you're not getting the opportunity to to see whatever those answers are so it's time to take action I'm going to take a look into what the bigger picture is in just a minute what else is here for Virgo what do we need to know Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, North Node for Virgo. So you're coming into some sort of personal power. And then we have power here already out. So there's something that's really taking shape. I do see the number 19 with this dice card. So in order to uh, come into some sort of upheaval, you need to take a chance. But that's going to require you to apply your emotions in a positive way. Whatever those emotions are, it could lead to love, okay? Or loving yourself. Being happy. Hmm. Okay, I did say I was going to tap into this look at the bigger picture card what is the bigger picture for virgo what does this have to do with in regards to virgo at this time what is the bigger picture for virgo something about a fire sign the four of wands is in reverse with the ace of wands and the knight of cups with the Six of Cups in the middle of the deck. So I feel like, Virgo, the bigger picture is not complicating your life to appease someone else. Okay? There's so much that might have happened in the past where you felt like things may have not been fully functional for you or something didn't work out for you, but that doesn't mean that's the end-all be-all. There's someone that, that wants your love or wants to give you the, the cup of love, okay? But I feel like you are, you could be holding back on reaching out for love or companionship 
dual T. feel like you're really holding back because you've been hurt in the past I'm seeing here that you need to bring some sort of resolution or to make peace with what you no longer have okay it's time to build it's time to live in your truth there could be a king of pentacles that wants to approach you very slowly or um, wants to be cautious or is cautious at this time tell me more what's here for Virgo we have temptation Spirit is saying that you need to avoid temptations because that could trigger doubts for you. You're in your beginning stages of your transformation when it comes to healing your heart chakra or whatever it may be broken at this time. It's time to forgive yourself and others that you may have thought hurt you or you hurt them. You need to allow your heart to heal so that you can come into your higher self. So there's something unexpected that could be taking place or showing up or being brought towards you that will bring great gratitude, but is it too late for this? Okay, because it looks like someone has an angle of working under the dark night of the soul in order to allow you to think that they've changed. is here for Virgo someone here could have been married or is married at this time maybe someone that's a part of this storyline or whatever is going on in this read someone could be dreaming about marriage or this could be something at the back of your mind that you want to work up towards Someone could be using some of their savings to help a family member or friend. Hmm. The number 49 could be significant as well as the number 13. This could be something about stability. So someone here needs not to be stubborn because stubbornness can lead to a humbling experience of someone being homeless. There's a family member that could be homeless here. There may have been some sort of ongoing investigation or something. Someone here could be 53, 55. Someone was falling short on, I don't know why I'm hearing like, leaving the place trashed. Nine of Cups. Someone could have been falling behind on their responsibilities or may have been tending to things that may have allowed their life to spiral out of control. Give me a minute here.
You know what I'm also hearing, Virgo? I'm hearing that someone used their savings to do other things with this. And this is what allowed their outcome to be. And now they need your help to get them out of their, their financial jam. So we have Seeker. There is a thirst for wisdom and truth whenever they, wherever they are with the child eternal at the bottom of the deck. Someone has the inability to grow up and be responsible. Extreme dependency on others for physical security. So yeah, I feel like this could have been a sister, a brother, a mother, a father, whoever. Someone fell behind and fell short because of their own doing. They allowed them their, their life to ramble aimlessly with not being able to upkeep their home. And yeah, someone could have been a gambler. Someone could have gambled their money away. Willingness to follow intuition even when others doubt you. So yeah, someone here could have taken a gamble with their money or used their savings to gamble money or deal drugs, whatever this may be, that didn't allow them to be uh, the person that they needed to be in their own life. So now they need you to fix or correct their mistakes. Someone could here be, be dealing with a smothering or abandoning children. So this could be a mother, someone that has children, instilling guilt in children for becoming independent. I've also seen Don Juan at the bottom of the deck and prostitute. So someone here could have got caught up in the wrong lifestyle or needed their, their they needed to survive. It was all about survival. Someone allowed their, their home life to be so torn that now they're struggling. Or this could be you. But I don't feel like it's you. You're the one that's going to be helping someone out. Hmm. Let's see what else is going on here. Virgo. So we do have grasshopper and dog. So there is situations in the balance that require careful handling with this dog energy, which means there is protection from a powerful friend, but there are still chains of events that could affect you stepping into this new experience, which could lead to good or bad karma. But I feel like if the box is here, you are getting some sort of good karma because you've you've helped whoever you needed to help to step into this new experience to focus on yourself. Okay? You will be receiving a gift in the month of June. This could be coming from a younger woman. This person is sent in to take help you take care of difficult times. Hmm. Give me more information or background on this grasshopper energy. Situations in the balance that require careful handling. So we have the Ace of Cups. Some sort of relationship or dynamic between two or more people that may have been um, destructured. This is someone that you don't really have a good relationship with, but y'all could be cool when you're cool. This could be a masculine energy. I'm also getting here. A king of cups and an emperor. These are two men. So this could be a friend. This king of cups could be a friend, a lover, uh, someone that you really care about, but you feel like this person dissed you or may have um, done something that goes beyond this person's honor. Yeah, I feel like this person that had an ego. There was some sort of ego trip between these two masculines where you're just like, I want to be left out of it. This could be um, Two of Pentacles, Knight of Wands with the Queen of Swords. So it looks like you're taking on the energy of this Queen of Swords at this time. You could be upset with two different men. It could be an Aries and a Cancer Scorpio Pisces because of how chaotic they allowed something to go and they're the ones that are angry with you because um, they're angry with you because you're telling them about themselves you're airing out laundry that should have been aired out a long time ago this would shock certain people into reality 
that like you can't do this yeah justice in reverse you can't do this you can't sit back and watch something happen and me not talk about it because you're not doing anything to make the situation better I'm hearing someone just sat back and watched while someone else suffered. And you had to put the pieces back together. And they're supposed to be grown men. Hmm. I'm hearing that you didn't mean for it to come out like that, but that's how it had to be. Someone forced your hand to say the truth. It may hurt, but the truth hurts. What's the kid for messages for Virgo? What is it that Virgo needs to know currently? So we have lovers, number 15. So you could have some sort of structural relationship with someone or you could be dating. You guys don't live together. However, it's like this person showers you with gifts and money. Yeah, I feel like this is, some, this is someone that is taking care of you, that you can honor here. If you don't have this already, then this is coming in for you. And this person that gives to you or that you're dating, um, this is not someone that you can say that is your, your man or your lady. But at least they're giving you, you know, that comfortability of, yes, this is possible. And, and you don't want this person to think that just because they're nice enough to, to give you these nice things or to upkeep your lifestyle, that that's going to be one foot in the door. They got to show and prove, and that's exactly what this person is doing. We have adjudication and then message of concern. Okay, someone here could have uh, forced a, more a motion to the court that may have not... Uh, had a, a, a positive result, okay? But I'm hearing that someone is still holding the faith. Yeah, I'm hearing that someone may have gone to the court to appeal something in regards to their housing situation, but um, I'm hearing someone is being denied. Someone here might want their, their apartment back. I'm hearing this apartment, if you want me to be real, Someone tr like trashed their apartment. Someone got caught up in drugs, prostitution, not being able to take care of their children or be the mother or father that they needed to be. And, and they lost their, their apartment here. There might've been a male that gone to prison over putting some uh, over uh, and got sick. There could have been a male in jail that got sick here. And I feel like this male can't even fathom to think about what this, where this child is. Someone lost their child to the system. Hmm. Let's see what else is going on for Virgo. So we have marital problems stemming from different personalities. Someone thinks they're smarter than others due to their background. So someone could be married or could have been married when this situation occurred. So you're winning, Virgo. Things are looking up and it's time to celebrate. At the bottom of the deck, there could have been an incident behavior at work that was reported to human resources, but you're uninterested and unbothered. Someone here is trying to make sure that you lose whatever winnings this is here. Congratulations. I heard promotion. Yeah. Someone steals items and resources from their environment to benefit themselves. Or 
or someone could be saying that you're doing this. Someone is thinking and strategizing on their return. Someone gives good advice to steer you in the right direction. So there could be some sort of incoming advice from a feminine, an older feminine that wants to see you win and has good intentions. Someone's holding grudges and plotting revenge and retribution on you and they're strategizing how to do this here, okay? Tell me more for Virgo. here for Virgo. So I do see cuffing season. There's someone coming in, as I said before, whoever this person is, they're going to be showering you with their time, their love, their effort, and their, their gifts, okay? And when I mean gifts, it could be spiritual and or material. And I see this person splurging on you because they know what you're worth. This relationship is coming up, okay? But some of you could be going in the wrong direction or may have gone in the wrong direction in your life where you could have trusted someone that had a lot of skeletons in their closet that feels like you jumped to conclusions before you even asked them anything. This could have been around um, Thanksgiving. I'm hearing pay attention to the signs and symbols that you get from the universe as well as numbers here because frequent numbers are messages beyond those numbers tell me more for Virgo so we have missing piece so you're missing a major piece of the puzzle in regards to a situation from Thanksgiving hmm we're going to get into that. Give me one more. Give me one more for Virgo, please. Okay, so we have life purpose. Someone here is really confused on what their purpose is on this earth or what they want to do. Someone here might be getting fired because of someone else's actions or what someone may have led your boss to believe. There is a lot going on behind the scenes that you're going to have revealed to you. Whatever this major missing piece of the puzzle is, it's going to all make sense. Let's see here. What is this missing piece for Virgo? So we have the world card. So there's something ending or closing out between you and some sort of knight of swords. I'm getting that you will not be made a fool of and you will be the one that's victorious in the end because you chose yourself. I'm hearing that this king of cups may have avoided telling you about some sort of um, divorce or children. Someone may have lied about, you know, transitioning or the changes that, that may have happened when you asked them. It's like they didn't want to give up information like that that may lead to uh, things like this where you end up leaving by yourself. So someone could have lied about, you know, their status or what's going on here. That's why I got marital, marital problems. Okay, someone lied about their status. Someone said that they've never been married or don't have kids or... Whatever the case may be. Someone's legally married but separated or whatever the case may be. And in that time that they've been separated from their person, they might have dated you. Mm -hmm. So this could be the, the same individual that you have this trial period with. Yeah, because this cuffing season card is coming out over here, okay? And whoever this person is, it looks like Cupid sent you a Sagittarius or someone that has Sagittarius in their chart that, hmm, maybe it's not it. What's this Three of Pentacles? 
We have the Five of Cups. Someone's going to be moving forward and leaving that situation behind. Yep, someone's going back, flying back to their, their, their home or wherever they're from. For some of you, I'm getting ATL. Someone lives in Atlanta. For some of you, yeah. This King of Cups is like highly disappointed in the situation in himself because he really thought that, you know, you guys were going to be together. Or she. All right, I'm going to go into the reading real quick to see what's going on. What do we need to know? So this could be the missing piece of the puzzle that we needed. It was about this individual, the suitor. I just heard that this person didn't know whether this, this, uh, this marriage that they were in if there was going to be some sort of reconciliation or it was over. But in any event, he was on a break or uh, se legally separated from his, his person. We have a Leo with the strength card in reverse with the number eight. It could be significant to you. I'm hearing that you could have known this Leo for eight years, but something has been severed because of, because of some sort of betrayal. Okay. Tell me more. So I'm getting the two of cups. You're separating from someone because you, you've found out that this emperor, this emperor may have um, blocked you up from knowing something that came as a revelation to you. I'm hearing that you felt like this person manipulated their way into your life without giving you all the details. Okay. Yeah, this person has a child. This child could have some sort of um, growth challenges and or um, something. Okay, so we have the fool. Someone here needs to take a leap of faith or there's some sort of new beginning that's going to kick off. What is this fool card? We have the two of swords. Hmm. Yeah. So what I'm getting here is that someone here feels like you're blocking them out. Meanwhile, they're trying to justify or come back in your energy. But you don't trust this person. You don't trust them. And whether it's brand new or it's been for a while, it's just kind of like you may be closing yourself off from anybody right now to figure yourself out. You could be distancing yourself because you feel hurt. You feel betrayed. You feel like you might not want to indulge for pentacles with the star card. Mm. Let's see what your spirit guides want to tell you. I don't think I pull this card here. What does Virgo need to know currently at this time? It's very unlikely. Something is very unlikely here. And I don't feel like you're in a position right now to forgive this individual. But spirit is saying that there's something better. Yeah, there's something better. All right. So Virgo, that's what I have here for your current messages. Hopefully it resonates. If it does, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, if you're interested in your own personal reading, then be sure to uh, be sure to email me. All the information will be in the description box below, and I'll see you guys in the next one.